Hey, how you doing? Welcome to another unboxing with Marty video. Uh, in today's video, well, this is what happened. Uh, I got a PC that I like to tinker with. I like to goof with it. And uh, every once in a while, I like to reset it. It's a uh, Windows 11 device. Um, and why do I want to reset it? Well, sometimes I just like to uh, go back to the, uh, it's a cool kids call it the uh, OOBE or the out of box experience. In other words, when you start it up, uh, it's a, it's a new startup and all of a sudden you're presented with the Windows 11 screen to set up the device, uh, set up your ID and such, uh, set up your printers. Uh, I like that. So um, some of you, you know, many of you probably know how to reset your Windows 11 device, uh, but it's something that we all should know how to do because why would you want to do it? Well, in my case, like I said, um, I've loaded a lot of software in there. I've uh, deleted a lot of software. I've added printers, removed printers, and sometimes just want to go back to the OOBE, out of box experience, uh, started up fresh. So um, that's what this video is about. So if, uh, well, just join me and uh, we'll uh, go through resetting a Windows 11 device. Oh, one other thing, check it out, you see this? Yeah, uh, I'm trying out the green screen effect. So uh, hopefully it works out first time. Uh, kind of exploring it, experimenting it, kind of teaching myself how to do it. So cross my fingers, hope it works out. Welcome to Unboxing with Marty. If you enjoy this video, subscribe. First and foremost, before we get started, remember to back up your files. Well, let's get started. First, Click on the start icon. Next, select settings. In the find a setting text box, type in reset. Hit the enter key. Click on reset this PC. In the recovery options, we see reset this PC. Choose to keep or remove your personal files, then reinstall Windows. Click on Reset PC. Here you'll be presented with a couple of options. The first one is Keep My Files, removes apps and settings, but keeps your personal files. Next, how would you like to reinstall Windows? You'll have a couple of choices. You could do the cloud download, download and reinstall Windows, local reinstall, Reinstall Windows from this device. If you want to reconsider your choices, click back. In this exercise, I'm going to select Remove Everything. It's going to remove all of your personal files, apps, and settings. Why did I select this? It's just a personal choice. I'm looking for the uh, out-of-box experience. I'm going to select the Cloud Download because I want to obtain the most recent available release of Windows 11. Okay, let's go over additional settings. Current settings, remove apps and files, do not clean the drive. Download and reinstall Windows. Cloud download can use more than four gigs of data. I want to go ahead and change the settings. Yes, I do want to download Windows. Clean the data, here I want to change this. I want to change this to yes, why? Personal choice. I want to clean the drive, and it may take hours, but it will make it harder to recover files. Select Confirm. Okay, I'm going to go over the additional settings one more time. Remove apps and files, clean the drive. Download and reinstall Windows. The cloud download can use more than 4 gigs of data. Click Next. So with the magic of video editing, we're going to speed this up. Okay, we're ready to reset the PC. Resetting will remove all the personal files and user accounts on this PC. It'll remove any changes made to settings. It'll remove all apps and programs. Download and reinstall Windows. Note, this will take a while and your PC will restart. Cloud download can use more than 2.62 gigs of data. And if you want to proceed, click Reset. For the device I'm using right now, this process is going to take probably about two hours. Uh, 
for purposes of saving your time, I'm going to cut some of the scenes out and I'm going to speed some of them up. Uh, so if you want, go get yourself a cup of coffee, but this is going to move pretty fast. Okay, well, we're into the boring part where uh, it's just going to start. We're going to see some black screens, some uh, status site percentages, uh, but this is what it is. Now, like I said, originally this device took two hours, about two hours to complete. Um, right now, we're just going to have to wait it out. Uh, like I said, if you want to get a cup of coffee, go ahead. But honestly, the thing is going to speed up pretty quick. By the time you get back, it'll be done. Look, we're already at a blue screen. Officially, it says it's resetting the PC and we'll just push on through. Uh, hmm, let's see. Oh, we're at 1%, so it's cruising. Oh, now it's 7%. Again, that's the magic of cutting this up and speeding it up on, look, we're already at 50%. And uh, boy, if this thing is cruising, isn't it? This is kind of neat. 75%, uh, you kind of get the drift what's going on. Uh, pretty soon this thing's, ooh, 99%. This thing is really moving, so. Um, <sighs> I would say, oh, another blue screen, it's coming back. And then, uh, let's see, here we go. Back to the boot up screen. Let's see what you got here. Yeah, can you imagine standing watching this for two hours, right? Okay, I kind of ran in and out when I recorded. I uh, wasn't gonna stand here for two hours watching it. But I, uh, like I said, I would run out real quick, grab a coffee. Okay, I probably went through three or four cups of coffee. Ah, uh, here we go. Uh, we're installing right now. We're at 9%. Again, we're going to speed this up. Ooh, 24%. See, what did I tell you? Uh, let's see what else we got. Uh, like it says down here in the bottom, your computer may restart a few times. And it will. And it has. Oh, now we're going back to the... Uh, the boot up screen, and let's see where we're at right now. It's, we're seeing a welcome. We're at 84%, like I said, this is what it is. Why am I showing this to you? Well, if you've never done this before, it's kind of a good thing to know what you can expect. So there's less surprises. And we're getting it just a moment. I think we're about finished. We'll know in just a moment. Uh, I love this waiting. And here we are. We're at the uh, start screen. This is what's called the OOBE or the out of box experience. You can see right here. Uh, we're at the uh, Windows 11 startup screen. Basically, this is it, we're done. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you found this a benefit, please be sure to hit the like and subscribe button. And as always, thank you for watching. Have a good day, take care.